Welcome back to the 2016 NBA Finals Game 7 here at Oracle Arena. We take a look now to Cleveland, Ohio, where Cavs fans hope that their team can become the first team to complete a 3-1 comeback in Finals history. LeBron James is one rebound off a triple-double tonight as the ball gets into Kyrie Irving on the left wing. Irving with Thompson on him. LeBron James comes up to set a screen. They switch. LeBron with Thompson on him now. He drives into his left, stops, kicks out to Jefferson. His shot off the rim. Green with the rebound. Green takes it up the court now. Curry gets the ball. Jefferson on him now. Curry makes a move. Shoots his layup. Off. Draymond Green with the follow, though. And the Warriors lead by four with five and a half minutes left in these finals. LeBron James with the ball now. Green picking him up. Screen switches Festus Zili onto LeBron. LeBron on the left wing. Pump fix. Zili jumps into him, and LeBron gets the foul. That's a tough matchup for Zili to guard LeBron James, and we'll see if Steve Kerr makes the adjustment and stops switching screens. As we look back into Curry's layup, not able to finish the layup, but Draymond's there to clean it up. And as you can see, J.R. Smith misses the box out there, and that's great awareness by Draymond Green to get in the right position so he can easily clean up that miss by Stephen Curry. And now, after further review, LeBron James will be shooting three three throws. As you can see, Azealia jumps right into him, and his feet are behind the arc. So now LeBron James at the line, 4-5 of five on the night, 27-38 of 38 on the series. About to shoot three clutch three throws for the Cavaliers. LeBron makes the first one, cutting the lead to just two now. As we look back, the Cavs obviously hunting that matchup of Zeely on James. And we'll see if they can keep exploiting that as the game goes on. James' second three throw bounces in now. Giving him 22 points on the night. James' last three throw attempt to cut the lead to one. And he sinks it. So LeBron James makes all three clutch three throws at the line now. Curry with the ball as he dribbles up the court. Getting into their offense, and Curry throws it right out of bounds. That is not a great play by Stephen Curry, and one he wishes he had back. As that is now the Warriors' 10th turnover on the night. And you can see he tries to throw it behind the back, maybe too much razzle-dazzle, and it just gets away from him. LeBron James with the ball now. And they go right back to the screen, getting Azili onto LeBron James. Now, Draymond gets back onto him. Another screen coming. Zillion James now. Step back three from James. It's in. Now LeBron James has put the Cavaliers up by two. Curry with the ball now. Passes it to Green. Thompson, his pump fake. Drives in. An easy layup for Clay Thompson to tie up the game now. With around four and a half minutes left. James now with the ball. No doubt they'll go right back to the screen action. Here they go, Azelion James. See, so size him up. Mid range shot from LeBron. Off the front of the rim, green with the rebound. Now pass to Curry. Wide open shot from Curry from downtown, and he can't make it. Jefferson with the rebound now. Irving with the ball now. Thompson on him. Screen gets Azealia to Irving. Trapped in the corner. Passes out to LeBron. LeBron passes out to Smith. Smith right back to LeBron. LeBron with Curry on him now. He backs him down. Turn around jump shot. Just a little short. Out of bounds. Warriors ball. And Harrison Barnes checks into the game for the Warriors, taking out Fest Azili so the Cavaliers can't abuse that matchup with Azili and LeBron James anymore. Kevin Love also checks into for the Cavaliers, taking out Richard Jefferson. 
tie game here with 3 minutes and 40 seconds left to go. Draymond Green inbounds it to Stephen Curry. Curry walks the ball up the court. Curry gives it to Draymond at the top of the key. Green to Thompson. Right back to Green. Thompson gets the ball top of the key. He drives in on Irving. Does a spin move. His fadeaway jumper off of the rim. Love with the rebound. Love gives it right up to James. And James walks it up the court. James now setting up the offense. They bring J.R. Smith into the screen, hoping to get Curry onto James. They get the matchup they want. Only five seconds left on the shot clock. James drives in, met at the rim by Iguodala, and James cannot finish the layup. Curry with the ball now. Let's his team get ahead of him. Draymond Green cutting and kicks it out to Iguodala in the corner. His three-pointer off of the rim. James runs into Curry on the rebound, and a foul is called on Curry. As the two help each other up, luckily none, neither are injured on the play. And see now James driving in. Iguodala is able to alter the shot enough. And then on the other end, LeBron James hustling for the rebound. That's championship basketball right there. And a loose ball foul on Stephen Curry. 2.50 left to go in the fourth quarter of this game. LeBron James joins Jerry West and James Worthy as the only players in NBA history to record a triple-double in Game 7. With 26 points, 10 rebounds, and 11 assists tonight by LeBron. We look back now to this play. As Iguodala contests LeBron James' layup, you can see he actually gets a piece of his hand there. And the Warriors are very fortunate that that was not called a foul. LeBron James tonight has his seventh triple-double in his finals career. Another impressive stat to add to his resume. But a win tonight will be his greatest accomplishment yet. Irving with the ball now, gives it to LeBron, inside the three-point line. LeBron looking for someone to pass to, gives it to Love. Love takes a jump hook, off the front of the rim, Green with the rebound. Curry with the ball now, as he walks it up the court. Iguodala with the screen, Curry passes it to Iggy. Iggy out to Barnes, Barnes pump fakes, drives in, Green with a wide open three. Off the rim and went out of bounds. The Warriors have had many good looks down the stretch here, but have not been able to convert as of late. And now the Cavs have the ball with 2 minutes and 11 seconds remaining. Irving takes the ball up the court. Looking for a screen from Smith. He gets it. Brings it to his left. Shot up, doesn't even hit the rim. Iguodala pushes the ball up the floor now to Curry. Back to Iguodala, and LeBron James pins it on the glass. LeBron James, out of nowhere, saves a go-ahead bucket for the Cavs. And he now has the ball at the top of the key. Let's his offense get set. And now dribbles into it. Iguodala on him. Five seconds remaining on the shot clock. Backs Iguodala down. Takes a floater, and it can't go in. Curry with the ball, lets his team get out in front of him. And now Curry gets a screen, takes a step back three, won't go. Off the side of the backboard now. Cavs ball, Irving with the ball, and Tyronn Lue elects to call a timeout here with a minute and nine left in the fourth quarter. This game all tied up. LeBron James with a great block there to save the Iguodala layup. As you can see now, pushing the ball up the court quickly, LeBron James times the block perfectly. Curry and Iguodala ran that break perfectly, but LeBron James' freak athleticism was too much for them. And with how these offenses have been playing, points are hard to come by, and that was a very important block as this game goes on. The Cavaliers have one timeout remaining in this game, and the Warriors have two. Both teams have a foul to give as we get into the final minute of this game, all tied up at 89. The Cavaliers will inbound the ball now out of the timeout. Ball goes into Irving. 
Thompson on him. Smith to set a screen. They get Curry onto Kyrie. Kyrie isoing now. Takes a step back three and puts it in. Kyrie Irving with a huge shot over Stephen Curry with less than a minute remaining in his finals to put the Cavs up by three. Curry now drives in. Gets a screen from Draymond. Love onto him now. Curry dances around with the ball. Can't go anywhere. Love's all over him. Pass it to Green. Green has nowhere to go. Right back to Curry. Curry with the pump fake. Dances around Love some more. Takes up a shot. And it won't go in. LeBron James with the rebound. Irving with the ball now. Is he pushing it up the floor? He's like, no. He throws it back out to Love. Love to LeBron James. And now Harrison Barnes will foul LeBron James with 18 seconds left. And that might have been a dumb foul by Harrison Barnes because all that does is reset the shot clock now to 14 seconds, which means the Cavaliers can run an extra 3 seconds off of the clock. And now the Cavaliers prepare to inbound the ball here. 18 seconds left in the game. Cavs up by 3. The ball's inbound to Kyrie Irving in the backcourt. He must get it across midcourt. He does, and he keeps on driving down. Met at the rim. Finds LeBron James up for the dunk, and he is fouled at the rim. With 10 seconds left, LeBron James took a hard fall there and is in some pain now. LeBron James still on the floor here. As he now rolls over. Seems to be his right wrist that is bothering him here. As the athletic staff comes over to check in on him. LeBron James thankfully is able to get up here as we look back at the replay. LeBron James goes up for the dunk there, fouled by Draymond Green. And you can see as he falls to the ground, LeBron uses his right arm to brace his fall, which is what he was grabbing at earlier. This is a great find by Kyrie Irving. And a smart foul by Draymond Green as it makes LeBron James earn the points at the 3 throw line rather than getting an easy dunk. And now the Cavaliers have used their last timeout because of LeBron James' injury. So they are out of timeouts for the rest of the game, which could come up big if they are stuck inbounding the ball. James at the line now. 7 of 8 from 3 throws on the night. with two huge three throws coming up to potentially ice the game for the Cavaliers. And he misses the first one, keeping it a three-point game with 10.6 seconds left. If LeBron James is able to make this next three throw, he can make it a two-possession game. All of Oracle Arena cheering against him. And James makes the second three throw, making it a four point game now as the Warriors take a timeout. They will have one remaining. And another big play for the Cavaliers here towards the end of the game by LeBron James. Now with 27 points, 11 rebounds, and 11 assists on the night. As we take a look back now to Kyrie Irving's shot over Stephen Curry. They got the switch that they wanted. Curry onto Irving. And then Kyrie just goes to work on Curry. Is able to shoot it over him and make a clutch shot. Putting the Cavs up by three. Kyrie Irving showing up when it matters the most for the Cleveland Cavaliers here in Game 7. And the fans back in Cleveland love what they're seeing. And they are now only 10.6 seconds away from winning an NBA championship. Wars with one timeout remaining and the Cavaliers with one foul to give here as we get into the final seconds of this Game 7. Shumpert into the game for the Cavaliers on Stephen Curry right now and Maurice Spates in for the Warriors. Iguodala set to inbound the ball here. We'll see when the Cavaliers use their foul to give. The ball's inbound to Clay Thompson. 
He has nowhere to go. Throws it into Draymond Green, and Draymond Green is fouled with six and a half seconds remaining. Both teams are in the bonus now. And now the Warriors will set up again. Iguodala to inbound again. Or is it able to get into Curry? Curry, step back three. Won't go. Straight to the rebound, but it's too late. The Cleveland Cavaliers have won the NBA Finals and have ended the 52-year championship drought in Cleveland. LeBron James has finally come through on his promise to bring a championship to Cleveland. And the celebrations start for the Cavaliers as the Warriors walk off, ending their 73-9 season in disappointment. As cameras swarm LeBron James, he's overcome with emotion right now. He goes to the floor. The fans in Cleveland are going crazy. They love it. LeBron James showing raw emotion here, the true passion he has for the game. As Cleveland are championships of the NBA.